All right, welcome back everyone. We're just going to roll on to the next set of chips. And forgive me for using the word roll because the next set is Roller Force. And we just get started. Times 10. So just like the, the last videos, it's probably going to take roughly about 30 minutes. And I think I was lucky enough that I had all three roller forces, you know, the two, the three, and the four star. So this one is probably going to be all dupes. Um, not sure if you saw that in the description, but just letting you know regardless. And uh, the hope is, is that I'll get something. I do like to have my collection completed, but worst comes to worst, I'm just going to get more dupes so I can get another 5 star combat bot. Yeah, 4 star dupe, that's what I like to see. I don't know where his bottom lip is. Yeah, I bet you I'm gonna click on that um, with 80, one of the 85 chests by accident. Not sure what day you guys are watching this video. Uh, it is November the 28th, Cyber Monday. And um, this pack that I'm opening came out from Black Friday the 25th. Um, for Cyber Monday, they released a, another one. So the first, what was it, the first three days of the holiday weekend, the Friday, the Saturday, and the Sunday. That was combat bot related bundles, um, the limited edition ones that is, and that one came with combat bot shards. The next three days, the, the well, what was it? not the three days, I think it's just um, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. Okay, so not a full three days, but uh, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, uh, they have regular five star shards that I do plan on getting um, the more five star combat bots the, the better your team's gonna be right or the stronger better is questionable depending on who you talk to but uh, I mean there's not a, a, a maxed out 67 five star bot uh, that's going to be close to uh, I guess relatively close to like a, a maxed out 67 four star bot, you know. Uh, my best comparison is uh, I have, uh, you know, a five star Optimus Prime and a four star Optimus Prime. And it, I think they're at least like 2,000 points away from each other, you know. So on top of uh, my main account right here, I do have a backup account for the Decepticons. Um, reason I even did that was because I wanted to see if there was any difference between the uh, campaign. Uh, there was a slight difference in some story, um, but that's just strictly the campaign. If you did um, any event, the events are exactly the same. Um, I, I did put a little money into that account too, which was uh, you know bad on my part. Um, 
but I don't put any more into that because I don't have time to devote, or I don't have that much time to devote to all those different things, you know, like multiple accounts. So, uh, sorry, I got a little sidetracked. Uh, so on that backup account, um, I also completed the recent event uh, for um, Thanksgiving. It was only 1,500, or 15,000, sorry, 15,000. So I was able to complete that. And during that event, if, if you guys forgotten or didn't play it, um, it was really just about combiner pieces. So if you finish the whole event, you got 10 combiner crystals for pretty much every combiner. Um, no surprise that Metroplex, I'm sorry, Metroplex, Trypticon, and um, Overlord, and Omega Supreme weren't included in that. That shouldn't surprise you. I accidentally said the Titan names, um, including Scorponok and Fortress Maximus, but um, those guys were not included. And what I'm doing is I'm debating if I should do a stream about that one, or should I just open it and call it a day? I think that's what's kind of good about a lot of games. The good games will let you like kind of look away for half a second to do something else. I know that sounds a little weird, but maybe it's because you know I, I have other things going on where I need to where I'd like to look away while certain things are happening. If my eyes are glued a hundred percent of the time. Uh, I think that's a great emotional investment, but again, that that's for some people. I, I feel like for myself, I can't give 100% um, attention to like one game when I have other things going on. Uh, maybe when the point comes where I don't have so many things going on, then it's like, oh, this game's too boring. I want something that has me enthralled the whole time. But for now, uh, I like exactly how this works. There's the plus 10, so I can just hit the button and walk away for a sec. I can, uh, the, the game, you know, has short, like, what, four minute matches. So I can go do something else, you know, uh, straight through, uh, you know, like 10 of those matches or 15 of those matches. And it's only like, what, 30 minutes? So it's fine. crazy on that one unfortunately.
Want four star dupes? Give me four stars. Uh, now, when it comes to these uh, Decepticon combat bots, I really don't devote too much combat spark to them either. Uh, what I try my best to do is like uh, store it up for my main faction, which is the Autobots. Um, it's better. It's it's better, I guess, <laughs> to max those guys out first. Uh, the stronger they are, the stronger your team is, and the more likely they are to win battles. It's as simple as that. That should be the goal. Get them stronger. Everything else is secondary, right? Now talking about um, combat bar, combat bot spark. Oh my goodness. Um, the good news is, like I think, like what the first few levels, like one, two, and three, they're relatively cheap. They're not relatively cheap. They are super cheap to upgrade. So, uh, depending on what's going on with my um, one Decepticon team. I will put a little bit of, you know, spark and combat spark into them. So, um, I don't want to make it sound like I don't, you know, I completely neglect them, even though they, they really don't care the Decepticons and stuff, but, um, my main goal is to make my main faction stronger, because I need to win wars, right? That's the, that's the whole point. The, it's a team effort, the team is counting on me type of mentality. I should really look up what good these guys are. I, <laughs> I know what Slugfest does. He's Zor's counterpart, and I was chasing Zor for a while. Roller Force, I think he had like a an attack speed upgrade. Um, and a lot of times I'm not sure who to put those attack speed upgrades on. Now, I'm not sure if you saw that, but um, the the number four popped up on um, on the lower right of the screen. What that's supposed to indicate is that I got another five-star combat bot, and it almost feels like every time I clear out one of these um, uh, three, 340 chips, I'm getting a five-star. Um, I'm not entirely sure that justifies that price tag I mentioned from the last video and that price tag was uh, buying every one of those limited edition um, 
combat bot related bundles. Uh, when you add up, and again, this is in USD, the 100 and the 40 and the 20 and the 10, that's about 170. And like I said, I bought both factions, so just double that right there, and that turns to 340. You know, um, I'm not sure if that is properly justified. $340 for, um, what's that, uh, for eight combat? Right? $340. And each 340 chips that I open is kind of giving me that, right? So five combat bots. Sorry, five. Eight combat bots? Theoretically, theoretically. I don't know how many I'm going to get. Um, I, I got two, right? Because that's the sec second time it popped up. Um, Eight for 340 bucks. When it comes to this game, you know, saying it like that, I, I, it almost feels fine. That's still a lot of money. <laughs> yeah, that's still a lot of money. And all of a sudden, somehow, for for my mind to think there's value in that, I don't know if I'm right or wrong. <laughs> Talking to a free-to-play player or a person who doesn't even like mobile games. Or like those, um, you know, uh, predatory microtransactions. Uh, I can kind of feel it from their point, but I'm, because this is the game I play the most, and I do really like playing Transformers Earth Wars, I'm like, wait a second, I think that's great. <laughs> you know? All right, about halfway done, I think, right? That was 180, and now we're at one. We'll be at 170 in a second. So yeah, that's halfway. up what good roller face is. That one name by the way? No, roller Force. Oh my goodness, I've been saying roller face this whole time is roller force. Be a little embarrassed. Shows where my mind was. Now, let's see what these guys do. Increases the movement and attack speed of all the nearby alley bots. Ally bots. Hmm. So if I connected him with like Blaster, or in this case, um, Shockwave, sorry, Soundwave, would that make more sense? Have the minions run around three or four times faster? Interesting. Or uh, I see it says attack speed, but it's not really saying if it does um, increase like the health regeneration speed or you know like a, a beam from who would it be from from ratchet oh, I'm sorry from hook from shockwave from flatline who am I missing or um, 
or the uh, or the camera guy. I forgot his name. Reflector. Uh, you know what? The uh, newsletter saying throw him a gnaw. Maybe. Seven more clicks. Yeah, I wonder. Um, yep, now those are the sounds of the house. And comically, the laptop fan is getting a little loud too. What I'll probably do is just uh, pause it right after this one and then start it up. Don't want these sounds to bother you. Alright, only a few more. Almost done. About to call that dial.
like one more after this and we are good. Hear my uh, background. Um, so what this pretty much says is that I'm doing this in the basement. No surprise, that's where my office is. But that's what I would know. And um, that's the heater, so I'm going to pause it right here. And last one. Terror Dacto <laughs> Pentron Double Cross Double Crosser Roller Force you Name Jizza Jizza All right, so that's gonna take care of this video. Um, like I mentioned before, the the five star that I got, I'm going to do that on a separate video. The next video is going to be unlocking this one, which is uh, Baru, if I'm saying that right. Yeah, I think I'm missing a lot of his, so I will find out. But I want to thank you for watching this one. Uh, please like and subscribe, and if you have any constructive criticism, feel free to leave it below. Thank you. Bye-bye.